When I first read the synopsis for this episode, the biggest question I had in mind was, what was Wendip doing in the golf cart? I had to crash the thing anyways. Does Wendy have a learner's permit but bad driving skills? Was Dipper teaching her or vice versa? Was there a monster attack? Or was Dipper driving when he got, um, <laughs> distracted? You know, this is really a lot of fun. Wouldn't it be nice if we could keep driving and go someplace far, far away? Personally, would have preferred the last one, but the canon answer is all right. I still get amazed at what Wendy is willing to do for cheap thrills, and the amount of her craziness that Dipper is willing to put up with. True, he's been growing up with Mabel, but hey, Loma's cupcake launcher never tried to possibly break the law. Also, speaking of Wendy and the golf cart, she seems awfully cheery about it being wrecked. I know not much gets to her on stuff, but she usually puts up with the craziness by shrugging it off. Or at least an aw man. I don't really recall her reacting like a Mabel and being so optimistic in the show. This is pretty nitpicky of me, but it's something I noticed. I just don't know whether or not I should make a big deal about this out-of-character moment. Well, look at that. Two paragraphs into the script and I haven't even gone to the starring character this short. We can immediately see that Seuss has really been experimenting more with the editing programs more than the twins. I feel that with these shorts, the quality of their videos keep increasing. Dipper made zero attempt to edit and was straight to the point. Mabel mainly experimented with cutting and trimming the individual clip and a couple transitions. Seuss here seems to be taking it to the extreme, importing photos and failing to use a green screen. And, well, just being weird. Seriously, what is that? Also, we get a look at Seuss's break room, which has had some serious renovation done since Carpe Diem. I mean, look at it. I'm just gonna go through a couple of the items in the room, but not all of them. I'm pretty sure a billion other fans will do that for me. First off, we got callbacks to Double Dipper, Fight Fighters, and The Land Before Swine. I'm also seeing a reference to an upcoming short that was leaked earlier. Bronies are now canon. The table of miscellaneous tools shown at the start of the short, and the poster of Stan for whatever reason. Headcanon away in the comments, people. Also, I'd like to hear headcanons for who drew that. Was anyone else pretty annoyed that the Disney XD logo was covering up the most important part of that joke? It just kills it. Also, another thing I noticed. When they wrecked the cart, Wendy fell on top of Dipper. I don't know whether to make fun of him, squeal the shipping material, or feel bad for the squished dip. <laughs> so when Wendip asks Zeus to fix the cart, he says yes and does some weird stuff and apparently never bothered to give him any content, and then they start fixing the golf cart. And no Dipper. No girl's going to think you look cool if they're too busy making you do all the work to even notice. Plus, you're not supposed to be cool. You're too short up for that. Seuss is doing all the technical stuff that only a mechanic follower can ever understand, so don't ask me. And Dipper is pacing around doing nothing. I get that Wendy is making you do all the work, but you really have to push down to Seuss. Also, how did the lightning hand thing turn into wolves? And what exactly is Dipper's purpose supposed to be in this shot? This just doesn't make sense. It doesn't. So you want to be a player, but your wheels ain't fly. You gotta hit us up to get a pimped out ride. You got to pimp my ride. 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 Damn right. You got to pimp my ride. Oh. My. Gosh. That is actually pretty rad. <laughs> like, that is like really cool. My mom would die for that. And even more with her ex-boyfriend. Yeah, he would want that. Also, where did he get the money for that? Forget that question. How did he get something that's apparently illegal? Headcanon below, my friends. Headcanon below. Thanks, guys! Ten out of 
of ten. Ten out of ten. The score for safety, zero.